Hello everyone, I'm Alicia. Welcome to my Beautiful Nights channel. For this video, I'm going to open up another monthly subscription from Check Beads Exclusive. In case you're interested in this box, I will leave a link for it down there below in the description bar. And I'm also going to leave individual links to the beads that I got in this box in case you don't want the whole subscription, but you want certain beads out of it. Now, if you can't find the beads that you're interested in down there below, it's because I myself could not find them on the site. They were either sold out or the code wasn't working sometimes the code doesn't work i don't know why that happens like that but it does sometimes so anyways let's go ahead open this up and like i said you will see all the links down there in the description bar okay so we have this little flyer here for their store they now have a store that's in prague that you can go to instead of just being an online store and here's both of their subscription boxes and yeah okay now here is the theme love story you know what that means that means flowers and hearts right some of my favorite beads here is everything that we are going to be getting in the box and oh my gosh these are gorgeous so I think the name of this bead was actually called a cloud something like that I don't know I saw it I forgot but I thought it had something to do with a cloud now do you guys remember these are new we just started seeing these in the subscription boxes there was a Bohem style monthly subscription box that had these beads in it, but they were pink and blue. Uh, not like this mixed together. I mean, the bead was either all pink or it was all blue. I'll put a picture up now of the project I'm talking about. It was a necklace and bracelet. So yeah, I've been seeing these lately they're extremely decorative really gorgeous so I love those I want to say it's some kind of a cloud bead I don't know if it'll be on the paper I wonder if it's this one here, Rhombus Beads, 19 by 9 millimeter. Might be, but that's not what they call it on the site. It's called something else. So I'm going to put that there. And these here, these look like little washers. or not washers. Nuts. I can't remember if I use these in a weaving project or stringing. They have really big holes. And they're great for using with leather. It's like a 1.5 millimeter hole. Do you see how big it is? It is huge. Like just putting this on, on a regular stream project, there's going to be a lot of room. You might actually have to put a seed bead in there. What, what I do whenever I have beads have really big holes and I'm using a, a small thread or wire, I fill the hole up with seed beads or bugle beads. Bugle beads are really great for it because they come in all different lengths so that's what they look like really pretty I have these in my stash in silver and gold and they look just like metal so those are great for working with thicker cord we have earring findings in silver and I thought that was a rubber band these are ball head pins and copper. I don't have that color in my stash. And then we have eye pins in silver. We have head pins again in silver. These have really big heads. Do you ever notice that when you get head pins? Sometimes the head will be so small that you put the bead on and the wire completely comes out the other end. And um, you have to look for your, through your stash to find, you know, bigger uh, tops like that. 
But um, what I've also done to fix that is I've made um, a fancy, I just used regular wire and I made a, a, my own head pin. Here is copper earring findings. I don't think I have that color or mustache. I sure am loving the antique copper. I've been obsessed with the antique bronze for years, but now I feel like I'm moving to copper. Oh boy. There are the flowers. So, I'm trying to remember what this color is called. I wonder if it's nebula, but I'm not totally sure. Maybe it's not. It has um, purple splatter on it. Do you see that? It's blue with a purple splatter. These are four millimeter check fire polish beads. And I'll get just a couple out. So we can see. They're really pretty. And in here I have to go through for this next because they look really great with this. This is um Little Vega Luster. That purple, I think it is. Don't those look great together? I love these. These are three millimeter. This color, I have this in Silkies, Super Duos. It is the prettiest shade of purple in beads. It's the best one. You're never going to find another purple that is as pretty as that. That is number one. Here we have flowers. And I've actually used these before in a Bohem Style project. Oh, and also a necklace that I did by myself. It wasn't a Bohem Style project. I did it with Check Beads Exclusive. Um, I'll go around and put some pictures up now so you have an idea of what I'm talking about. Anyways, I think this was the color that I actually got in the one necklace. I think it was a necklace and bracelet. And it is gorgeous. When you put it, it looks green, right? But when you put it up to the light, I swear there's like blue and green in it. Like it's two-tone. Like aquamarine. That's what it looks like. Put it up to the light if you get this box and look at them. They look like aquamarine. It is gorgeous. And this is a silver wash on the bead. It's silver. So those are amazing. And then we have it in brown. Oh my gosh. That bead. I gotta go find out what that color is called. It's really pretty. Okay, here's the brown one. It looks like we have some are darker and some are lighter. Like this one here has like a root beer color and then that one's really dark. Again, they have silver wash. They're beautiful. I really like the green ones. And this here. This is gorgeous. It's dark red. This is Nebula. I think this is the Nebula line. Do you see this? I hope my camera is going to do this justice. It is so pretty. I'll pick some out. There's this Nebula. If you're a lover of the um, AB finishes and like the iris beads, the Nebula one will blow your mind. Right here. Look at that bead. So I've seen this in the purple and blue and it is just mind blowing. Yeah, I think I might have a purple one in there right now. So let's go for that next. Okay, so that one's the dark red. And yeah, I think this is the Nebula. In my camera, it looks like it's just luster, but it is not. It's a rainbow color over it, but it's over the whole bead. And it's not AB. It's so pretty.
You know when you blow bubbles and the color, there's actually color in a bubble. You can see it swirling around. Purple, pink, blue. That's what this looks like to me. It's so pretty. So I think that this is the Little Vega Luster purple with the nebula over top. Yeah, it is. So that's that's epic. And I love these together. Those look great together. I also think that the brown looks good with all three of those. And the green. Yeah, I love purple and green. Okay, those are awesome. So far, the box is mind-blowing. We have three millimeter turquoise check drugs. Yeah, I'll leave them in the bag. There's a lot in there. Maybe 50. There's a bunch. Oh, I'm going to go to this. We have the helm. Uh, I got this. We're now in January, so I got this last year. And I don't remember if it was in this box or if it was for a project. What did I do with it? I can't remember. I'll go look through my pictures and see. But it's really neat. I think I got it with um, bronze, though, on it. I don't know what this is. This finish. But they're pretty darn cool. Next thing, I'll do this flower now. I think I got this flower in the past too, but I can't remember if it was a project. Or beads, just beads. I don't know if it was this box, I could have got it in another box. It's the same flower, but instead of a metallic wash, it has a turquoise wash. They're very pretty. Okay, and I'm going to go to this here because I just glanced to this and thought of an idea. So this flower here, we get this flower all the time in this subscription and some other subscriptions that I get. But um, there's this necklace that I made with this flower and it's been some time. I'll put a picture of the necklace I'm talking about. That necklace is made with multiple colors of this kind of flower. So whenever you get multiple colors and you have small amounts like this, uh, that necklace right there was a really great idea to uh, do with um, flowers that you have few of. So like this here, that these would work in a necklace like that. But you would want more colors, of course, different colors. And uh, just put them all together on head pins and stream into a necklace like that. So there's an idea for you. Those look really good with the blue on there, I have to say. And we have matte six millimeter check trucks. I used a six millimeter, no wait, it was four. Six, uh, four millimeter white check trucks to make my Beaded snowman. I'll put a picture of that up now. Those are gorgeous. I like those. And then this. This is a maple leaf. This leaf design is very pricey. Yeah. I've never seen it in this color. It looks really cool. It looks, it looks like it's uh, frosty. 
like it's frozen or something. It's pretty. Oh, and it has to go with those. They are meant to be together. Yeah. Green hearts. I think these are nine millimeter, eight or nine. Oh, there's those hearts again. I forgot about those. I love those. I got them in red last year in a Bohem style necklace. I'll put a picture of that necklace up now. I loved all of the colors in that necklace. This color is amazing. I think it's chartreuse green with luster finish over it, which is a like a pearlescent color. It's like plated on there. It's permanent. It doesn't come off. But it's like a whitish pearly glow, I guess I would call it. Okay. And these hearts, I have to go to these hearts. Is this? Oh my gosh. No way. They put the little Vega Luster onto the heart as a coating. Um, I wonder what this heart looks like uncut. This heart is table cut, by the way. So like the Hawaiian flowers, we've seen what that flower look, looks like before they cut it and after. But what does this look like before they table cut it? Isn't that precious? So see the purple there on the side? These are gorgeous. I also really love the red ones that I got last time. This is a really epic box. Oh my gosh, they gave us those hearts too. So we have this milky pink here. Check hearts. color is so gorgeous. I never get tired of this color. This is actually has stripes in it. I don't know if you could see. There's little stripes in the bead. So it's not just that color. It actually has a pattern on it. Okay. And then these hearts. Now last month I got this same exact color but in tulip. They were tiny tulips. Do you remember? And now I have a matching heart to those. Yeah, I gotta put this up to the light. So it is blue. It's so pretty. And then this, this is like my new favorite flower that's drilled like this, this shape here. It was the Hawaiian flowers. I was obsessed with those. They are so darn expensive, but this here has such amazing detail. I went on to Check Beads Exclusive. The, the, the website's actually called Craftica, but their boxes still say Check Beads Exclusive. Anyways, I went onto their site, and they have these in a bunch of different colors, and I can't remember. I think I put these in my cart, but this flower is called an anemone flower, and I think because, like, in real life, this right here would all be standing up like tentacles, the little spiky area you see right there. There is um, this one flower that's called a passion flower. That's really pretty. I used to have that in my yard as a kid. Yeah, and the passion flower kind of reminds me of this one here. So I love those. It's my new flavored flower. It's so gorgeous. Okay, and then we have, oh my gosh, I gotta go to the bear. It's a charm. He's kind of double-sided. Just his eyes, you can't see any other side. 
This is matte gold. That's so cute. He's really cute. I think I want to use him in macrame. I want to attach the macrame here to this loop and then maybe in between his legs right there I can use that hole for the other side. Put it in a bracelet. But he's really cool. He's like he's like an inch long too, in case you're wondering about the size. So I love him. And then we have some six millimeter pink check hearts. And I'll, I don't think I'll worry about opening that bag. And we'll go on to this here. Is this another bear? Looks like there's a few of them. Oh my gosh! We got that in blue. I think I have this one and this one right now on my card on, online. I didn't make my order yet. That's kind of funny, huh? Hey, that's the same color right there. Let's think about making earrings those what would it look like oh there's four I thought there was three the little walking teddy bears or is it a dog kind of looks like a dog because of his ear and his uh, face maybe it's a teddy they're cute okay so there's that and none of them want to go into the bag. Okay, and right here. So here's another anemone flower. White with blue wash. These, like the Hawaiian flowers, come in a bunch of different sizes. I've had them where they look like a quarter. In this size. I think I've only seen two sizes. Wait, is there a smaller one? I can't remember. I don't know. Anyways, look at how pretty. It's very pretty. And this is like the same as this flower here, so that makes me want to use them together in something. So I love that. Right, so that's everything in the box, and this is it. What a nice selection of beads, huh? I love all of these colors. They're really pretty together. Yeah, those are amazing. I can't believe they did that color combo. It's like my favorite, and they put that together. Oh, I have to see what these look like together. Yeah, I like those together. And probably these. Mmm. Man. An earring done with this. Or those. Or maybe all three. Have like, Make like a really long earring. Put this at the bottom. You can't see. Put that, this at the bottom. This and then that. Or this, this and then that. That would be cute. So this is it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this box opening. And remember I will put a link for this subscription box. So check this exclusive monthly subscription box down there below in the description bar. And I will also put individual links here to the beads in case you want like these flowers and these beads over here, but you don't want the other things. Okay, so if you want just certain things, I will link it down below for you. All right, so this is it. Please like this video, leave me a comment, subscribe if you want to see more of my videos, and make sure you click the bell button so that you get notified whenever I upload new videos. And follow me on my social media sites. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter. Thanks for watching.